Hey guys, my name is Jo. I'm from Korea and I'm currently working in Singapore. It's been almost a year since I moved here, so I thought to share how my average day looks like. There really isn't anything special in my life. I just have a super cute dog whose name is Choco, which I think is still worth a share. My day usually starts around 5 a.m. with a little bit of cleaning, and then I'll go for a walk with Choco. She loves running around. She has so much energy as a two-year-old. So I better keep her busy and tired while I'm still at home so that she can have a good sleep while I'm away at work. After I feed her, the most important morning ritual begins, which is making coffee for myself. I'm a big coffee lover and I can't really afford buying coffees outside. In Singapore, it costs around 45 bucks for a good coffee, so one of the very first things that I did after I moved to Singapore was buy my own coffee machine. But I gotta eat some manuka honey before I drink my coffee. It's good for my gastrosis. And Choco loves it too. After her manuka treat, Choco sleeps in peace. Which means I can go to work in peace. Due to the coronavirus outbreak, I wear masks everywhere I go, especially during my commute. After a few minutes, I walk to the MRT station and a half an hour MRT ride. I arrive to the office building where we do the temperature screening again because of the virus. It's breakfast time. And some work. Around lunchtime, I'll hit the gym, which is in the same building as my office. I used to do pilates and bar, but I just started going to gym, so gym workouts are really new to me. I'm still exploring, I'm still learning, watching a lot of YouTube videos related to fitness and my leisure time. Quick shower, feeling refreshed, then cater lunch at my desk. Today, I order a chorizo wrap. work, I also check out how Choco's doing over camera connected app to make sure she's doing okay. And also take some supplements like vitamin C to keep my immune system strong. Then of course back to work. And more work. Finally, let's call it a day. It's 7.50 now already and was a long day. I hate to leave the office late, but you know, on some days, you can't really help it. It's a bit later than usual, but we're still going for the night walk. A bit later than usual as well, but I'm still having my proper dinner because fuck it, I had a long day. Yeah. 
In the meantime, Kyoko is having a buffet meal. More playtime with Joko and massage time for me. While I'm getting massage, Joko stared at me with that cute little face and then falls asleep first, which means I gotta go to sleep too. Good night.